Okay, so if I'm someone who I understand, okay, I need to embrace this concept of failure, but there's some people that it's like the, the concept of doing something that is outside their comfort zone is so paralyzing that it's hard to get started. Is there any exercise that is, or a system that people can use that can get them outside of their comfort zone? Mm -hmm. Sure, so um, I like to embrace comfort zone challenges. Mm -hmm. And in itself, it sounds pretty scary. Comfort zone challenges, meaning you go beyond your comfort zone. Now, I recognize that many people have this problem of mm, being paralyzed from taking the first step. That's why I believe that instead of trying to aim high and not taking the right step, being paralyzed, it's better to aim a little bit lower. You know, do something that pushes you just a little bit. Embrace those small comfort zone challenges. So, you know, in the context of building confidence and especially social confidence, social skills, I like this free strangers day exercise where essentially, you know, you uh, approach free people you don't know on a daily basis. You don't need to have a big conversation with them. You can't say anything. The point is you push yourself to initiate a connection, even if it's something like, excuse me, do you know any supermarket in the area? You've been living here for 15 years, you know where the supermarket is, it doesn't matter. The point is that you want to push yourself and you have an excuse to talk to them, right? Mm. That's one example, but, but there are many different comfort zone challenges and you know what, we can later on perhaps give some challenges together to the audience.